smart garage door openers are dumb. Now I haven't tried all of them and maybe they're not all dumb, but let me tell you a story. A few years ago I needed to get a new garage door opener so I went ahead and I did that and I opted to get the smart one with MyQ installed and it was about $100 more than the one that didn't have Wi-Fi but I'm like hey it's worth it because it's smart it will do cool things it will make my life easier. So I got it installed I installed the MyQ app and I started using it and I realized you could open the door you could close the door and it would give you basic notifications but if you wanted to do anything beyond that you needed a subscription yay the subscription wasn't super expensive but just to do some basic features like integrate with google it seemed really ridiculous to me anyhow after about two months guess what it stopped working i spent about two hours trying to get it to work i gave up waited a few more months then i spent two more hours trying to get it to work still didn't work i got on with support spent an hour with support they sent me a new board to install in the garage door opener. Now this board itself cost over $100. I spent a few hours to install it. I got my hands all messy. Then I was so excited I could finally use the smart functions on my garage door opener again, but it still didn't work. So fed up with that, I went on to Amazon. I did a search for a smart garage door opener device. I got the cheapest one I could find. I installed it in about 20 minutes and it was so much better. I think it's called the Morose Garage Door Opener and it had all the functionality I wanted with my original garage door opener. It could do custom notifications for if your garage door was open for too long. It could automatically close it. You could set a schedule to close it. It integrates with Google. It integrates with Amazon. Close the garage door. Is the garage door open? Checking. Hang on. Garage door is closed. The Morose device was cheap enough and I've had it long enough that it was cheaper for me to get that than it would have been to buy the MyQ subscription. Yeah. So I don't want to say all built-in smart garage door openers are dumb because I haven't tried them all. But realistically, if you do have a problem with it, you're going to have to replace the whole unit, which is really expensive, or the board, which is a big hassle and expensive, or just get an inexpensive device like the Morose. And if that goes bad, you can replace it, it takes hardly any time at all, and it doesn't cost very much money. As you can tell, I'm kind of bitter, but I really like the Morose Garage Door Opener. It works really well. I'm very happy with it.